So I think it must have been through, I guess through the rugby circles initially, probably seeing the barrels, I think, which have been, are they for keeping whiskey in? Yeah, so... I think. So that's probably how I first seen them either, and I would imagine, as with most of the things in the world, it's probably through social media, yeah. that, that I'd noticed that, and then I guess probably doing a little bit of a... Uh, being a bit nosy, probably on social media, let's have a look at Oak and Black, let's do it, and then probably sitting next to, to you, Freddie, at a, probably the Sporting Start dinner, finding out all the different things that you do, listening to the, I guess, the full range of your products, and then just trying to match up what we're doing here at Loretto and, and my role as Director of Sport is to, is, is there an opportunity to, to form a bit of a partnership? I think the biggest, but things look really good, which I think is, is really important. All the, the the products that we've bought from you so far have, have been great. They've been customised, which I think is really important. They're sustainable, which I think is, is really important in the, the current environmental sort of climate that we're in. So I think I'm really mindful of, if we're going to spend some money, can we spend our money in as economical and environmentally friendly a way as possible? So I think the oak being much better, I think, for the planet than buying a, a shiny metal, which is plastic based or, yeah. and I'm thinking, and I've, and I've got them, these little plastic trophies that I probably won as a kid, and, and it looks okay at best, whereas I would love our kids in 10, 20 years to open up their drawer and then they find a, a lovely little piece of handcrafted wood with some, something in it which, which means something to them. So we've used, I think, quite a varied, a varied range so far, I believe. So I think the first ones we used were end of year awards, which were, were awarded internally to our pupils, to the players of the year through each year group. We had most improved. Um, we had our, our school crest put on it, uh, the date and the reasons that they're, they're getting their awards. So they were probably our first venture of of using Oak and Black's products. We then went on tour to Northern Ireland on a pre-season trip and it's always nice to give something to the people who are hosting you. So again we got the one of the bigger oak blocks which had a little crest on it, Northern Ireland uh, summer of 2022 which we could give to the the visiting teams as a, as a gift. So th th the latest thing which we've done um, Every, every week we have our headmasters double, which for other schools would probably be an, an assembly. And I've, I've been at Loretto five years and it only really just twigged to me that we, we quite often would get an award for winning something or in sport it's the winner or the loser. We have the mathematician of the month, somebody who's done very well, probably the, the kid who's done the best in the internal exams or things like that. And I wanted to to do something to recognise the kids who are doing well every month. So we have the sportsman or sportswoman of the month and not necessarily the best on the on the pitch. So we're looking at a criteria of commitment to the team, uh, playing the game in the correct manner, sporting, helping your teammates and, and trying to work out that may, may be the best sportsman or woman on the pitch but it's probably somebody who's contributing and, and they're setting a good example. So we awarded that for the for the first time last week, uh, September 22. A young girl called Isla who had been the, the keeper for the B team in hockey who had quite often put her hand up to double up and be a keeper for the younger year groups and, and just setting a really good example of going between venues and, and having to get there in her full goalkeeper's kit which, which is not easy. We've had a young lad who's just joined us um, who was the sportsman um, of the month winner and he'd just been setting a really good example of staying behind at training and helping his teammates and I think that for me is something they will get to keep the big block for a month it will then come back in and be rewarded but they will keep one of the little mini blocks forever and I think when they then look back at some point in the future and if they find that at the bottom of their their drawer I think that will mean something to them which for me I think is important in my in my role at the school here is is to try and create that that culture where we we applaud and, and we know that there's more to just winning on the on the pitch as to what means that the kids have done well and, and they've contributed. 
I think it'd be an easy thing to recommend Oak and Black. So I think, again, the things which I really like is the fact we can get the Loretto crest customised onto the blocks, whether it's the the bigger oak ones or whether it's the little mini ones. And I think, yeah, in my honest opinion, that makes a huge difference as to something has been personalised. It look, looks great and it's environmentally friendly. So. There's lots of different things that, you, that, we, that we can use and I'm sure there's more ideas that we can come up with to, to tap into making something, something special that the kids are going to remember, the parents will look at it and there's, there's so many different things that we can, we can use the Open Black products for.